What's up, everyone? Welcome back to an indie adventure in Outer Wilds. Last episode, we uh, we got everything ready. We observed the uh, the town. Oh, oh, okay. Luckily, fall damage isn't a thing. Um. And the elevator conveniently comes down again. Okay, let's get back up. Like I said, last episode we uh, we kind of explored the place. We went to the zero gravity cave um, and, and and practiced a little bit in uh, zero gravity kind of anal repair. I don't know. You have to see the the last episode to fully understand what I did there. Uh, but we got the launch codes from the museum slash observatory for our spacecraft over here, and we are about to embark on our journey to um, a very hospital. Hus hus hospital? Hospitable hospital. Uh, I guess I'm gonna need a hospital soon. Uh, to a very hospitable place. Let's get up in our spacecraft. Look at that. I haven't actually been in here. The hatch automatically closes behind us. That's convenient. This is our, our space stuff, I guess. Space suit. I guess we're gonna need to gear up in a, in a, in a minute here. Uh, this is actually our combustion engine, which is gonna drive the spaceship into space. This is... Um, ah, oh, look at that. This is Timber Hearth... The sun. These are actually little planets that we can go on and explore, but is there no way to... Is this all? Doesn't look like a lot. Of course, I don't know how big each of these planets are, so I guess we're just going to have to see what's uh, what's up there. Anyway, let's uh, let's suit up. There we go. Guess we're going to have to see in practice. Let's uh, buckle up. Okay, now there's a bunch of controls here. Oh, there we go. Just hold shift and everything goes according to plan. We're off into space, everyone. We are off. Look at that. That is a beautiful view. Okay, let's stop accelerating. Can we... Yes, we can just turn with the mouse. Set that as a target. And then... Matching the target velocity. There we go. We are now floating in space. This is awesome. This is very cool. Look at that. Wow. I don't, I'm not really sure who made this game. I believe it's available on Itch.io. I'll put the link in the description below so you can check this out for yourself. But it is very, very cool to just be floating around here. Look at that. Okay, I think it's time we uh, we went uh, exploring something. Let's uh, let's put something with easy. Let's go with the moon. Press spacebar to match the velocity of the moon. There we go. Now we can slowly come nearer to it, I believe. And then we just press spacebar again. Let's see if we can actually go... No, 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 it's... It's difficult. What's happening? Are we... We're crash landing on a moon. And... We've landed. Okay. Thank God. Okay. So we actually went to a different planet. Does it actually say in the computer now? Yes! Look at that. We went to... Not Brittle Hollow, we went to the moon, right? That's not right. Okay, I, I believe. Are we in my spacesuit? Yes, I did suit up. Uh, let's go outside. Let's open hatch. Wow, look at that. Yes, it's over there. Look at that. Okay, let's now try and land safely. Because all of these planets are so small, they have very high uh, rotational momentum, so it's very difficult to... There we go, to land safely. Hi! I came from there. How are you doing? Welcome! It's not often I get visitors up here, you know, it being the moon and all. What can I do for you? Well, uh, anything here worth checking out? Honestly, I think this place is pretty dull. I mean, look at Brittle Hollow's moon, it has volcanoes. Now that has a moon. I think that would be a good place to explore next. I mean, why not go all out in my first adventure and try and explore something that's actually worth exploring? I suppose the view from the North Pole is pretty spectacular. It's the pointy red marker on your mini-map. Yeah, I, I, I got that. Wow, where's the music coming from? I, I wanted to ask him that as well. See that radio I cobbled together over there? It calibrated it to pick up the music being played by the four other travelers out exploring the solar system. Oh, I see. You have a very cozy, cozy place here. You know, with these uh, boarded windows, um, no doors. Must be very windy up in here. Oh wait, no, there's no wind on the moon, right? Okay, I think it's time we went back to the ship and uh, see what other types of planets we can actually discover. I like this little animation here. You step into the orange thing and it goes whoop, and you're inside. You bang your head on the on the ceiling as well. This is actually pretty cool. Okay, what is next? What is next? We could actually go to Riddle Hollow if I can find it. Let's see if we can. 
We're up now. Let's hope the moon's gravity doesn't actually grab us. No, I think we're safe. Um, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, careful. <laughs> we almost crashed back into our home planet. That's okay. Let's get a little bit more distance away from these two guys. And let's see if we can find this little hollow thing. It looked like a big fiery mess. Is it there? I saw something exploding over there, but no. It is not. Is it there? I don't know, but it looks interesting. So I think we're going to go that way. This is great. Okay, we're almost there. Let's uh, try not to crash into it. And I, uh, oh, 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 no, oh, what's happening? It's, uh, we got a warning for something. Okay, let's, let's kill the velocity, please. The, the ship is in need of repair or some, something. I don't know what's happening, but I think we're gonna, uh, we're gonna have to get out and, and see what we can, we, we have to do. Okay, open hatch. Let's go outside. Um, let's go and see. I thought there was something going on here in the front. At least the scanner indicated there was something. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's happening? Is there something I need to repair somewhere? Oh, yes, there is. Look at that. This thing is obviously... Oh, what's happening? I keep crashing into... Thing. Let's get back inside. Oh, God. Oh, I think... I think we're gonna have to take some distance away from everything because... Did we land? <gasps> We've landed. The ship actually landed itself. It's a very handy feature for a, uh, a spaceship to have. I think it's time we uh, we repaired some things now. Let's see. This thing, this thing is broken. Use my stereo eyes, just like I did in uh, in practice. It's a good thing we uh, we managed to practice that. Repair this thing as well. There we go. Everything's a okay, and we managed to land on a different planet. Now, I believe this was the weird double one, was it? With the, the stick in between them? Yeah, there we go. Something is connecting these two planets together, and there seems to be something rather interesting over there. think I'm going to have to want to take a look there. I'm not sure if I can get there with just my jetpack. I think I'm going to have to use my ship for that, but... Uh, whoop. Get back into the ship. Okay, that is where we want to go. And please don't, no, let's try not to crash land. Please, 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 please. We actually did that quite nicely. Look at us. We're starting to become space explorers. And I have no idea what kind of planet I just landed on. There's big cacti everywhere. And there's a blue glowy thing here. What is this? What is this? Is this some sort of space pod thingy? Look at this. What is this? Are, are these some sort of stasis pods used by the first explorers of my race? Or, I don't know. This is all very creepy and very, 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 it's very something. Some sort of fruit? I'm getting the idea that, all, that, that most of the experiences in this game are going to be, what's this and what does this do? Which is good, in my opinion. I like games that do that. But, uh... This is a truly, truly gorgeous game. Look at that. This is very, very cool. I think I'm going to stop it here for uh, for this episode. I'm thinking I'm going to do one or two more episodes. I want to see uh, a little bit more of what there is to see in the galaxy. Maybe go a little bit further away. Maybe to uh, someone like, uh, like, like that guy over there. Uh, he seems to be moving pretty fast, so I don't know if we can catch up with him. But uh, thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you in the next episode for more of Outer Wilds. Bye-bye.